Speed versus Wolverhampton Wanderers. A brilliant performance on his part, but a, a disappointing performance on the team's part. Look, at the end of the first half, Sarantin was leading 1-0. But one important aspect about this, the strikers playing for um, lower tier teams is that even if you're a striker, you tend to defend too much. And that is what I saw from Antoine Zemenyo. He was moving back to defend, blah, blah, blah. And then he would go back to attack. How would the striker have the energy levels to attack? attack and how all right all right yes thank you very much for staying with us once again and joining us on this channel sport 7 gh it's always always a pleasure to have you join us yes so we are bringing you the very latest update concerning some black stars players who are playing abroad and who are playing the english premier league or oh, yeah over there yeah but please do want to subscribe to the channel if this is your first time watching us here on this channel like this video hit the notification bell and select all do all to leave your thoughts and comments below in the comment section if you have any it's always always a pleasure to have you join us yes andrew Didi Ayu is the black stars captain of the senior national team of ghana yes and um, he moved from Qatar to the english premier league to play for Nottingham forest um in the this particular season for the rest of the season so he signed a six month deal he's been playing um he's played two matches for Tottenham, um, Nottingham forest since he signed but all of them has been from the bench and he plays just some minor minutes um for for nottingham forest over there as we are bringing you the update so that is the news on andrew the day are you but his his strength his his levels of um, participation in the team are is there and he's doing very well um slightly well for himself as i would say yes um now let's move to his brother jordan are you jordan are you was in action versus Tarek lamte in the english premier league um that is versus, um, crystal palace versus brighton and hove Albion. at the end of the game um uh, it ended one one and so both sides um took one point from the game now um Tarek lamte came on from the bench um for Br brighton and hove Albion, but then Jordan Ayu um, started the game and ended the game. So he played 90 minutes for his side, Crystal Palace. Jordan Ayu there for Crystal Palace is very an instrumental part of them, mainly because he attacks very well and he defends very well um, for the team. And so Patrick Vieira likes him very well. Yeah. So after the game, the two players yeah, had to take some pictures and all of that. And Jordan Ayu told uh, Tarek Lamte that he's very um, proud of him and that uh, Tarek Lamte is doing very well for himself at, at Brighton and Hove Albion over there. So that is Jordan Ayu versus Tarek Lamte, two Black Stars players going head to head or toe to toe in the English Premier League over there. A very brilliant and fantastic performance from Kamal Din Suleimana. Yes, um, for Sarhanten as he played versus Wolverhampton Wanderers. A brilliant performance on his part, but a, a disappointing performance on the team's part. Look, at the end of the first half, Sarantin was leading 1-0. Um, Kamal Din Suleimana was running, was dribbling and getting a lot of shouts and all the, the praises over there. At the end of the second um, second half, um, Wolverhampton Wanderers came back to score 2-1 and surprisingly Wolves had um, a red card in that particular game in the first half of the game and so you would you would um, think that if Wolves have gotten a, a, a red card and then also um, they are losing by 1-0 at halftime then Sarantin who is battling relegation should ensure that they win that particular game but they failed to win and that is a very bad one over there but after the game come on into the manner said a lot of things you know he did very well like i'm telling you and then he was asked that how did he see perform his performance and he was like oh it was good but then that wasn't the exact performance he wanted it wasn't an excellent or perfect performance because he had his finishing or his decision making not so much on point and that he is hoping that going forward he will be, be able to have his decision making very much on point so that is Kamal Din Suleimana speaking um, after the game versus Sarante but they lost they lost they are still at the bottom of the English Premier League with 15 points 
and hoping that they will get out of there. But they've sacked their coach, Nathan Jones. Um, yes, that coach of Southampton has been sacked. In that particular game for Southampton, um, Kamal Di Suleimana was not the only play Black Stars player in there. Mohamed Salisu was there and he did very well, even though they considered two goals. Um, as a defender, he did very well for himself, getting a rating of 7.5 um, with so far score. It tells you that indeed he played very well. Yes, but then the team is generally not playing well. But I can say that those two Black Stars players are doing very well. I'm still hoping that those two players will get out of the relegation zone and and then stay in the english premier league because we cannot have them go to the championship no even though they are quality players but we should have them in the english premier league over there yes let's talk about antoine semenor of bournemouth antoine semenor also signed from um bristol city to bomb off in the english premier league um during the january transfer window um his first match he had a full 90 minutes game played fairly good missing some key chances and all of that but then in the second game which happened over the weekend on saturday he started from the bench versus newcastle where they drew 1-1 he started from the bench yes came to play like 15 minutes of the game and there too he was good but one important aspect about this the strikers playing for um lower tier teams is that even if you're a striker you tend to defend too much and that is what i saw from antoine zemenyo he was moving back to defend blah 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 and then he would go back to attack how would the striker have the energy levels to attack and have the excellent finishing if he's doing all of those jobs but that is what comes with it then i was very sad for antoine zemenyo watching him versus Bournemouth over um, for Bournemouth in the English Premier League over there. So yes, those are some of the Black Stars players monitored um, who did fairly well in the uh, over the weekend over there. Please do all to subscribe to the channel for lots more fantastic updates. Like this video, hit the notification bell and select all. Leave your thoughts and comments below in the comment section. It's always always a pleasure to come your way. Bye bye.